Hello audience, I want to teach you how to increase your push up in the line in no time, no amount of time. I'm going to teach you. I don't want to talk too much to waste your time. I don't want, I just want to delve into the don't want to delve, I don't want to delve into the video and do it fast because I have something to do. The first step most people don't use what it's called progressive overload. You have to overload the push up you're doing, maybe, and you have to change the vibration. This is what an example examples like this. Maybe I can do this push up easy. That's one. I don't, I'm not going to do um, this type of push up. I don't, I'm going to try to put weight on my back. Oh, I'm going to start doing the one arm push up. So, tip number two. I don't want to waste your time. Go delve the facts. Some people are not sure enough. Maybe frequency. The frequency is low. I have to train at least four times a week. Maybe doing push up four times a week. It's okay. And everything and doing everything too much is bad. The next step that many people will not increase their push up is they do not do their train frequency is too high. You don't have to train too high, man. You don't have to train two hours a the week. You have to wait for your muscle to cool in order to build muscles faster. And wait another way. To increase your push up is this you have to start doing the small push up like this one small small then you increase this um frequency frequency and you do it and don't have to train too much or you know, while your train frequency will be stupid you just lose muscle rather than build the muscles and build the strength because building muscles also leads to strength three maybe some people say you're gonna some people have to lose fat and just to go and do and push up. Um, losing fat will not only increase your push up. What you're going to do to increase your push up is you have to pack up some muscles. You don't pack up some muscles, it only leads to strength gains. And I'm going to talk fast, fast. Another tip not to increase your push up is you have to, no, I'm not eating healthier. You have to pack a decent amount of muscles so you have to lean back. Lean back is like taking the right calories, maybe 100 plus above your maintenance calories. So maybe when you eat the protein, but not too much. So if you need a protein, go and fill in your muscles, go and fill in your body with the amino acids and increase your protein synthesis. If you've got protein synthesis, you're going to um, um, gonna build muscles when your protein synthesis is high and just eat to fill out the muscle soreness. The next step is that you're not training to fill. You have to train to fill. I mean, fill means like this. Maybe you're training push up. I've done 100 push up. Maybe I have to do um, five to train to fill. So after train, you cannot even. You cannot even do any more than five. You're you're suffering. So after that, you're gonna get muscle soreness. And if you got muscle soreness, you have to eat healthy. So fill in the mouth of the soul. If you don't eat, you will experience muscle soreness fast. And when it will move, it will um it will hurt if you don't. You have to um do this experiment. Train, not eat anything. Sleep tomorrow. You see of muscle soreness. After that, eat for the next three days. You will see that the full nutrient when pack. In your muscle, so it means that you're building muscles. So this is how muscles grow. The next way to increase your push up is by doing calisthenics. Yeah, calisthenics you don't have to lift only weight, man. You don't have to lift only weight, you have to just um start doing body weight exercises like this and those stuff. Cool out all this will increase your push up. Um, and you have to make sure you're doing calisthenics, maybe like this. Ah. It's all this calisthenics from my own mind. You have to try to do calisthenics. It's, it's very good. And first, I prefer um, gym done calisthenics, but now I like very good calisthenics. Very cool. The next thing why your push ups are not increasing is because don't eat the right food. That's what I mean. If you are going to train and eat a lot, maybe later you, you drank a lot of milk. My friend, your training will not be nice. You can't do even 10 push ups because it will be like vomit. So don't eat a lot when you're going to train, but you have to eat medium. You have to exercise a lot. You have to exercise a lot and have to um, increase your training frequency. All this will help to increase your push. I don't want to talk much. I just want to make this video short. The next and the last way that to increase your push up is one, you have to stop, start doing gym exercise. That's why I'm saying that because push up is a matter of building your shoulder. And your chest by building these muscles with gym exercise i promise you you're going to increase your push-up when i started training a year ago 
I did do two crochet, but now you can do one and press at 20. This is a strength of interest, and I can do a normal 50 push up, which is good. A light push up at first. People are gonna say, James, um, doing James is better than calisthenic. Many people say that, and I think maybe too, if you can lift your body weight, why will you say that? Why won't you say that James is better than calisthenics? This is my tips, and I find it very helpful. Please subscribe, like, and share. And I thank you for my for my uh, thank my audience for the example. Way to help you, but most people suffer differently. <laughs> but like me, I have a muscles a combination of muscles and fat. I can, I can maybe try to jack, jack, and maybe jack my triceps. You can see my triceps, but you can you don't, you don't see it definitely because there's a lot of fat there, and I have also muscles there. My chest too is muscles. And a little bit of fat, but I have six parts. Maybe people store um, fat differently. So losing fat, maybe maybe your belly that won't <laughs> make you do the push up fast. So these are all the tips I'm gonna give you. Um, please subscribe.